I only went down exactly the way I thought. And that what frightens me. Aftermath and Withdrawal Welcome back to Decision 24. Here I briefly talk about everything you need to know about the upcoming US presidential election. Oh my god! I was literally just about to upload this video when I found out that Ron DeSantis has suspended his campaign and has endorsed former President Donald Trump. Okay. Last Monday, former President Donald Trump walked away with a major win during the Republican Iowa caucus by gaining 20 delegates. With DeSantis, Hutchinson, and Ramswarmy having suspended their campaigns, the only obstacle left in Trump's path is Nikki Haley. Last week, I mentioned that the Iowa caucus does tend to force underperforming candidates to drop out. But I didn't think it was going to be anything this decisive. As we approach the New Hampshire primary that is set to take place this Tuesday, candidates are hard at work to secure votes that will grant them additional delegates for the national convention this summer. Now I just found this out, apparently President Biden isn't even on the ballot for the New Hampshire primary. Apparently it has to do something with the state not being compliant with the new DNC rules. I literally have no idea what's going on. Now before I wrap this up, I want to draw your attention to an interview that Nikki Haley gave a few days ago on Fox News. You can sit there and give me all the reasons why you think I can't do this. I will continue mm. to defy everybody on why we can do this and we will get it done. Are you a racist party? Are you involved in a racist party? No. We're, we're not a racist country, Brian. We've never been a racist country. Are you sure about that? Well, this has been a weird week. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below, and thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.